Have you ever been somewhere and seen someone that you thought was just so good looking? <laughs> and instead of saying hello, you just kind of watch them awkwardly from afar, like me. Well, today I'm going to be talking about how to attract that person you like in three different categories. Appearance, approach, and personality. Let me begin by giving the definition of what attraction is. The action or power of invoking interest, pleasure, or liking for someone or something. We've all felt attraction, but have you ever wondered what causes it? I'm going to take you back to biology class, the birds and the bees, and talk about pheromones. They're a chemical substance produced and released into the environment by an animal, a mammal, or an insect that influences the behavior or development of others of the same species, often functioning as an attractant of the opposite sex. Now that we have a general understanding of what attraction is, um, let's talk about how to actually approach someone that you like. First is appearance. Pretty much the best advice is don't look homeless or a hot mess like Perez Hilton. <laughs> also, personal hygiene is important. And this isn't just for relationship advice, this is life advice. <laughs> Brush your teeth, take a shower, wear deodorant, please. Um, and be confident, like Beyonce. Um, if you aren't confident in yourself and you don't like who you are as a person, then other people won't either. You have to like yourself if you want others to like you as well. Approach. Something people make vastly overrated and get really nervous about. This is my favorite YouTuber, Connor Franto. And I've been a lot of you guys around that age when you start dating. Oh, that age. So I think I want to help you out. And I'm going to tell you a couple things not to do when you ask someone else. This one works for both genders, by the way. Because I'm not sexist. <laughs> but okay, here we go. Number one, don't be creepy. Hey, so I've been watching you. Oh, hey, I look at your Facebook like every day. Oh, hey, so I was in your backyard last night and... Don't forget your words. Uh, uh, so I was um, uh, wondering, um, uh, 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 so you're, you're really pretty, um, like my mom. So, how about that weather, huh? Kind of cloudy lately. Don't be loud. Hi, I like you. Don't be quiet. Okay, so I'm going to be the first one who me to use my tools. Go Don't be too sexual. Hey, want to go out sometime? <laughs> Don't not be sexual at all. to do to attract somebody, but here are some simple tips to help you to attract somebody. Make eye contact, but don't glare, don't be creepy, don't, it's not like, it's not Braveheart, it's not that serious, you can't stare into someone's soul, so quick eye contact, look away. <laughs> then smile, come on, it makes you look approachable and friendly to somebody. And that's what you want. You want to be approachable to somebody. Um, also, if you show interest in somebody first, it makes them look at you differently. It makes, you, it makes them think about you later on in the day, which could help them be attracted to you. And lastly, personality. 
the most important thing, the easiest thing, just to be yourself. Be as weird and outgoing as you can be. If they don't like the real you, don't be somebody you aren't. It'll be worse later on if you act really shy now and act like yourself later and the person you like is confused by the sudden change. Again, be confident in who you are, like yourself before wanting someone else to like you. Conclusion. I hope this helps you in the future. Remember that confidence was one of the most important things and to like who you are. If someone else doesn't appreciate how great you are, they aren't worth it. Thank you. All right.